Tonight, the man police say shot five people, killing four. Last week in Cleveland, he's being held on $5 million bond. Martin Muniz was in court this morning. Lydia Espara tells us why bond was set so high and what was written in a newly surfaced social media post from him before those crimes. Young man, what's your name? His name is Martin Munez, making his first appearance in court for what investigators say was an unthinkable crime. The state will ask for at least a $5 million bond in this case. Munez is accused of shooting five people and four of them died. The fifth victim, an eight-year-old girl, was shot in the neck and is still in the hospital. Prosecutors say he admitted to the killings, showing no remorse whatsoever, even though some of the victims were family. One of the victims is his 70-year-old stepfather. The other one is his sister. Uh, the 16-year-old is his nephew. And the eight-year-old girl that so far survived uh, is his niece. The suspect appeared to Should be almost grinning that. as the prosecutor mentioned his victims. Three mm. News searched his Facebook page and found this. A friend asking, what's good, bro? Munez responding, nothing. The end is near. Bless you, my friend. Prosecutors say he is a huge flight risk, having residence in Chicago, New Jersey, while also having a criminal history in New Jersey and Florida. The high bond set for that and the murders. Now, Munoz is being held here at the Justice Center, and we're told he is set to get a psychiatric evaluation. And, Laura, his next court appearance is on January 23rd. All right, Lydia Spara, live for us tonight. Lydia, we appreciate it. Thank you.